a cure for a sore left knee, climb a fire tower. This is McCormick's Creek State Park. It is the first and oldest state park in Indiana. It is located 14 miles west of Bloomington in Owen County. Hey everyone, Silver Steeler here. And Winning Image Photography. Welcome to another state park or forest video featuring precious metals. Today we find ourselves in McCormick's Creek State Park. It was dedicated on July 4, 1916 as part of the state centennial celebration. The park was named after the area's first settler, John McCormick, who settled on 100 acres there in 1816, along the canyon by the waterfalls. Up to that time, the land had been hunted by Miami Indians. McCormick's Creek Falls is the main attraction. However, the main attraction for this video will be the fire tower. Where is that fire tower? Right there. Here we are at the base of the fire tower. This fire tower fell in disrepair, closing in the early 1980s. During that time, the cab atop the tower was locked by park management due to vandalism and for safety reasons. In 2019, the Friends of McCormick's Creek raised over $100,000 to restore the 86-foot tower. The 105 steps to the top are easy to navigate. The plaza underneath the tower is entirely new. Even if you decide not to climb the tower, the view from underneath is quite impressive. Built by the Civilian Conservation Corps in 1935, the fire tower arrived as a kit. It was put together over a couple of winter months. The CCC also built bridges, roads, and shelter houses in the park. The Man Fire Tower was initially built on a bare dirt hill. The entire park and the nearby town of Spencer were visible from the perch. The idea of the fire towers at the time was to have total visual coverage of the state. The plan was never realized. The CCC made pine tree reforestation efforts in 1935 around the fire tower. From the top of the tower, you are level with the tops of these giants. Gold at the top. made it to the top of yet another fire tower and as we've been doing in our past videos we brought up some more gold our fourth 10th ounce gold 2021 Britannia four nines fine gold another great addition to the stack they're winning now as far as the view from this fire tower it's a little bit underwhelming due to the fact that the trees surrounding it are taller than the fire tower these trees were planted in the early 1930s and they now are taller than this fire tower, so really not much to see on the horizon. Do we get a fifth Britannia? Well, I do know that you're already working on a video for next week that is going to be a little bit... Different. That's right, it is. And it's another fire tower, and it's more gold, so chances are pretty good, I would say.
McCormick's Creek State Park. Founded in 1916 as Indiana's first state park, McCormick's Creek has a rich history. Its earliest history is reflected in its geology. Fossilized corals tell of Indiana's time as a shallow tropical ocean. Bits of granite brought here from Canada share its glacial story, and flint artifacts tell part of its Native American history. McCormick's Creek and Southern Indiana were shared hunting grounds for the Delaware, Miami, and Shawnee before their forced removal. In 1816, the area's first settler, John McCormick, homesteaded nearly 100 acres along the canyon by the waterfalls. Since it was then common practice to name physical landmarks after the people who owned them, the area became McCormick's Creek. Early residents in the area cut timber, grazed livestock on steep slopes, and farmed small patches of flat upland ground. They also tried building sawmills on the creek, but the water level and force were never great enough to make them profitable. Other enterprising businessmen opened limestone quarries near the mouth of the creek, but soon ran into problems getting the cut rock across the river to the railroad line. And here's the cabin we stayed at. You know what the best part of this cabin was? What? It was only $66. Oh, here's the screened-in porch we watched Talking Bullion stream from that Monday night. That was a very nice cabin. I mean, it had everything you needed. Nice queen-size bed and a nice-sized bathroom. Originally, a little more than 350 acres, McCormick's Creek State Park has grown to 1,924 acres. Now, this is not the first time we've featured this state park on a video of ours. If some remember, we had the two-ounce silver brumby. We did a music video from a bridge, so we went ahead and revisited that bridge, took a couple pictures, and we also went to the waterfall that it has in this state park. And that's what makes this state park a little bit unique compared to some of the others in the state. It has a cave, it has a fire tower, it has waterfalls, it has a swimming pool, basically has about a little bit of everything that you would want. When we went there a year ago, this waterfall was a trickle. Look at it, the state it's in now. Some tea shots for future videos, but we gotta go. So remember to like, subscribe, and all those other good things. We'll see you on the next state park video. Bye everyone.